Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ4E, and welcome back to Medieval Dynasty. We're going to start off this episode by taking a look at our storage. Um, first of all, our storage is getting very full. We're going to do something about that today. Um, we are getting a good amount of clay, which is awesome. We are getting iron from our new iron mine. Iron mine? Well, it's not an iron mine. It's a mine, but I mainly need it for iron. <laughs> we have um, a lot of rocks, guys. We have a lot of rocks. Now, someone was telling me, Cage, don't upgrade your your small houses because you're going to be making the big houses, right? I'm going to make the big houses. Well, that is true. I'm going to be making the big houses, but, the, you know, they're they're a bit awesome. They're a bit ways off. I mean, they're starting to get closer now. Almost 7,000. Uh, I'm almost 6,000. Look at that going up, man. Check out that build. Check out that building technology going up. I'm watching it. That's awesome. Anyway, um, yeah, we're we're about six thousand building, and we have to get to seventy five hundred. Um, last time I built a small house, I was like, I was really low in building, so I wasn't just gonna wait for that, right? But I'm gonna wait for it now. Um, although there's not much more to upgrade, I'm not gonna daub the. I'm not gonna daub these things though. I'm not gonna upgrade this one either. Um, I'm just gonna wait until I get the better house and uh, start building them. So that was a good tip right there. Um, also, someone said even I was lamenting that you can't upgrade these buildings, right? Um, but that's because it's a tier one. The tier when you build a tier one, you know, storage shed, you know, hunting lodge, whatever you're building, it's gonna be made out of straw. When you build a tier two, it's gonna be made out of wood, and when you build a tier three, it's gonna be made out of stone. So I do have a lot of stone, but I'm thinking I was thinking at first I had enough stone, but now I'm thinking I don't. I probably don't have enough stone. We probably need rock. Is what I'm saying. We probably need to gather some more rock. The problem is rock is my heaviest thing in here. So that's going to be interesting. Um, I do also have firewood, so that's great. So we're collecting sticks. Salt is not really useful to me, but that's okay. Um, also, uh, there's something in here that's not... Oh, limestone. Limestone has no use in the game. Um, I, was I was instructed to throw it out on the ground and ignore it. I'm not going to do that. I'm actually going to sell it. And that is going to bring us to today's episode. We are going to finally do it, guys. We're going to make a storage place outside of the main town. Now, a lot of you guys said, well, you can't make the storage close to the main town. That's true, but I can make it a lot closer than, than any of these storage are, right? So that's what I'm going to that's what I'm gonna be doing today. So um, we're going to need logs for that. There's going to be a lot of logs in the area. So I'm debating whether I'm going to... I'm going to take logs to hold it. Why not? Plus, that'll help us... Uh, Get the storage up. Someone said their storage is 600. Mine's 1500. Um, all of the all of the resource storage buildings, their their storage is connected. So if you put up if you put like one down that gives you 300 storage and one that gives you 300 storage, you have total 600 storage in both of them. So that's how I got um, where I am. You guys should watch every video. I, I know it's I know it's hard in today's crazy world. You know it's hard to find time, right? But I, I do explain this stuff in all my videos. I get it though. Not everyone can watch every video. So if you guys ever have any questions, just ask me in my comment section, and I will get to it. Um, I think in a future episode too, I really need to expand the farm. The farm's not big enough. And what I think I'm gonna do, just you know, putting stuff out there, is I think I'm gonna make this all big one big farm out here. Probably uh, it'll probably start. Like, right here, it'll probably go as far as I can, and then probably cut over this way. And it'll probably be in the backyard of my house. Oh, I should have put a door here. You guys are saying I should have put a door there. Damn it. Is there a bed, though? Really quickly, I know I'm going off on a tangent here. Um, yeah, see, that wouldn't be a good spot for a door. You need to be able to move stuff around in your house, because this is the only good spot for a door. Look in here. I mean, if you put a door anywhere else, I mean, maybe right here would work. But that's right next to a bed. That wouldn't even look right. So, yeah, I mean, um, yeah, they need to let us move stuff around because there's nowhere to put a door. Okay, so I've totally gotten lost in my train of thought. Okay, got my train of thought back. This is what we're going to do. We're going to do quests. Um, we still need to do quests. We still need, you know, um, the quest rewards are actually really good. And you know what's funny? Like, um, when you look at these uh, quest reward for this Chapter 7, right? Oh, I need to also try and get a 10th person. When you look at this um, quest for Chapter se uh, Chapter 7, or sorry, 8... Um, you get 2,500 dynasty rep. So it's like, why would I do quests for like two to five dynasty rep? That seems like a, a big waste of time. And it kind of is. Um, but the thing is the quests give you other things too. Like a lot of these quests are giving me like over a hundred of a crafting skill. Um, although is a hundred of a crafting skill really that big of a deal anymore? When like, I need like 7,500. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. We're going to do them anyway, because, uh, it does give us something to do. And you know, we're here, to, we're playing an early access game. We're going to be testing these, uh, these features of the game. Do we have any place for the next person for ours to live? Um, see, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't think any more than two or four people can live in these houses. So I might have to build another house. 
in order to build another house. See, I don't think I'm going to make another simple house. You know what? We might wait. We might wait on that, um, you know, because we're getting, we are getting just an absolute butt ton of building technology. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to wait until we can make the actual house. I don't want to make another simple house, which is going to mean we're probably not going to be able to get another person uh, right now. But let's take a look at these people anyway. Um, six at diplomacy. Okay. I also need to look at my skills because I do want to respec in my skills at some point. So definitely want to look into that. All right, so none of those people are any good. You're no good, you hear me? All right, well, what we're doing is we're going to go up here because in Rolanica, Rol Rol whatever, there's a quest up there. So we're going to be heading up there right now, and we're going to do that quest. Um, I did have a couple things I wanted to talk to you about on the way up there. Uh, I already talked about building the Tier 1, 2, and 3 of the res research, resource sheds and stuff like that. So we got that done. Um, Clay, people just tell me Clay shows on the map. Like a lot of people were telling me that. Can you tell me exactly where? Because I don't see where Clay would be showing the map. I know there's Clay over here, but I there's not a, like like what on this map is showing Clay. It's not this brown stuff because it's like everywhere. So I'm not really sure about that. Um, oh, this game needs lights badly. You guys have been mentioning it, and you're totally right. We need some kind of candles or torches or something. Um, because, yeah, the, the lights are a real problem in this game at this point. Uh, if you're outside, you know, you got to carry that torch around, which is fine, but it really would make the village seem a little bit cooler if, like, you actually had lights um, around. That would be awesome. Um, as far as spears go, I was thinking about making the stone spear. I think I'm going to pass on the stone spear. I, I don't know. I might not make any... I don't know what I want to do with the spear, because the thing is, I don't find the melee ability of the spear, like, that useful. I find throwing it useful. But the thing is, once you throw it, you don't have it in your hands anymore. So if I'm going to make a stone spear, what should I make? Like two, three, four? I mean, I don't know. Like, is that is that really better than the... See, the thing I like about the wooden spears is they're very disposable, you know? Yeah, when I, I, I bring them with me, and when I'm done, I either sell them or I throw them away or whatever. I don't know. It just doesn't seem like... <laughs> the wooden spear is so disposable. That's what I like about it. And I don't think... An, an iron spear is definitely not going to feel disposable. So, I don't know. Um, let me know what you guys think about that. Do you carry stone spears? If so, how many? Do you carry iron spears? If so, how many? Do you do you melee with them? Do you do you throw them? What, what do you do? Because, I don't know. I feel like the wooden spear is just fine. I don't really see the need to upgrade. I guess I could do the stone spear. Um, but I really don't see the iron spear. Is that useful? Like, it's going to be expensive in iron. And then what am I going to do? I'm going to throw it. And then, like, I don't have anything in my hands. Am I going to hold multiple... Iron spears, they're probably going to be heavier. Okay, and here we are. And there's my quest. F5. Romwald. Romwald. I don't know what the hell. Uh, can I do something for you? Hey, young man, I need your help. I'm an I'm elderly per I'm elderly person and I am unable to craft tools. Can you please uh bring me an axe? I won't forget to reward you for that. I'm sure, I could do that. All right, so this guy is going to need an axe. Let's see what he gives me for it. Um, see, that's what I'm talking about, the 250 crafting. That's freaking unbelievably cool. And he only needs stone axes. I, I'm, I'm going to let you guys in on a little secret. I was tripping over stone getting into this place. It was freaking everywhere. So, so I'm going to need four of these, right? And I'm probably going to need some sticks as well. I don't think I have any sticks on me. But there should be some lying around on the ground. How many do I need for an axe? I need like ten, right? Oh, man, there's a lot laying on the ground. But you only get one per pickup. That sucks. I like the bushes better, but it's it's winter. It's going to be a, it's gonna be hard to find bushes. So let's go ahead and make this guy's axe. Okay, and here we are. Is that my guy? That looks like my guy. That's my guy. Here's the axe he wanted. Thank you so much. I know a few crafting recipes from my old days. I will show them to you. Thank you. Okay. He didn't really show me anything, right? <laughs> well, no, that's the crafting. That's the cra Oh, cool. They actually put the crafting into the quest. Like, oh, that's awesome, dude. Yeah, see, these these quests aren't bad. I mean, I'm assuming I'm going to need to grind Dynasty Rep eventually anyway, even though I don't really need to right now. Um, but, yeah, I mean, like, you gave me a... You gave me... That's a lot of crafting skill, dude. I need to get to 2,500 points. He put me within striking distance. And then I can make the second tavern. That is awesome. All right, that was definitely worth it. Mother effing wolves. What a pain in the ass. Biting my ass. I don't, I don't appreciate that. And this is the winter, too. It's not like I could just pick those flowers that heal you. So, gotta be careful. Oh, look at that. Didn't give me his woods. Didn't give me the spear back by um, harvesting him. Okay. 
Well, that's a change I have to pay attention to. So, can you guys tell where I'm going by uh, going through Wolf City here? Wolf Town? What do you guys like better, Wolf City or Wolf Town? Uh, oh, damn it. There you go. What a dick. Yeah, yeah, that's right. I'm going to Hornica. There's a quest down there. But first, I have to make it through Wolf Town. I think I like Wolf Town better. So thinking more about it, I'm thinking I'm going to make the, the Iron Pike and use it as a melee weapon. See if it's any good. And I think I'm going to get back into the bows. I know bows have been updated um, since last time I played. So I should probably give the bows another shot, that's for sure. Plus I can make the longbow now. And um, I'm pretty close to be able to make the, the recurve bow. And uh, the crossbow will be there too as well at some point. So yeah, I'll definitely check out the bows again. Might as well. All right, let's go ahead and F5. These two. Look at it. It looks like they're walking with their arms around each other, but except his arm's through her stomach and her arm is through his back. That's crazy. You people are weird. All right, can I help you? Oh, thank God I fixed them. Can I help you with something? I need help from a strong man. I will pay for it. Well, I'll let you know if I find one. <laughs> Just kidding. Consider me interested. I have to feed my family, but the food went missing. I have coins, but not time. That shouldn't be too hard. I'll be right back. Okay, she wants, just wants some food, or... Let's take a look. Um, 60 coin and 3 dynasty rep for berries. Okay, there, I can't get berries for you. So, I might be able to buy them. I could save them. Guys, even if I had berries saved up at my base, I'm not going back to my base and coming back here for 3 dynasty rep and 60 coins. So, <laughs> alright. Well, at least one of the quests is worth it. So, now is the time to build our resource storage place outside of this town. Now, I don't know which side would be better. I need flat ground. I think probably... Th nah, I want to go this way if I can. Yeah, let's see if we can go this way with it. And I am going to need 10 logs for that, but in order to get logs, I need to make some room... In well, I don't have to make room in my inventory, but I want to. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to sell all the wooden spears because I'm not going to be in any trouble right now. See, this is why I like the wooden spears, guys. They're 110% disposable. That is awesome. So if I want to make room in my inventory, I can do that. All right, so I'm going to need 10, 10 logs. So let's go ahead and chop down some trees. And let's get some logs. I love this freaking axe. It's dope. Dope axe. It's my dope axe. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I know you can't build this that close to the to the building. That's fine. That is just fine. We'll build it as close as we can. And we're also going to need somewhat flat ground here, which is going to kind of suck. Let's go ahead and grab the feather. I know you don't need feathers for the iron arrows yet, but they could change that at any point. All right. Um, storage. Food storage. Resource storage. When can I make the next one? And it's not until 10,000, guys. I'm, a, I'm only a little bit over halfway there. So, yeah, we'll go with the third. All right. So, can't place this object that close to another village. We're going to wait for that to go away. Um, I know I can't put it on the road either, but that's okay. Um, another, next to village. Another village. Should be able to place it down pretty soon. Okay, any second now. Uh, oh, I saw... Yep, there we go. Stuff blocking. Okay, so we could probably put it around right here. Come on. Come on. Still close to another village, huh? Uneven placement. There we go. Research storage. Close to another village. Okay, I think that's a pretty decent spot for it. Let me uh, save, though, in case I don't like where it is. I would like it facing the road because... I don't know. What the hell does it matter? Well, yeah, I don't know. Makes me makes me happy. All right, so close to the village, and boom. All right, so that's not yeah, that's not too bad. It's a lot closer than my base, you know. Well, is it a lot closer? Let's go to main. Yeah, it's 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 still it's still a decent amount closer my than my base. I need to make. It's not like I'm making this storage thing for no reason. I have to make this anyway, um, because. I need more storage space. And it doesn't do any good in my town. It does a lot more good there than in my town. So I am going to go home. I'm going to sleep through the night. We're going to build that thing tomorrow morning. Should be a lot of fun. I'm trying to decide when I want to get rid of the tier one resource storage shed. The first one I built. <clears throat> Although I don't see any reason to get rid of it. Well, yeah, because I'm going to be at 19 and 20 build limit. So I, w I will probably want to get rid of it at that point. Um, because it's getting annoying. I have to repair the damn thing all the time. And it's a, it's a relic. Of a long gone age, you know what I'm saying? So we're just gonna go ahead and build this one up for sure. And then we're getting, I got a lot of stuff to unload too. Okay, we are getting there, people. We are getting there slowly but surely. 
why don't we go ahead and drop the sticks right here? Because I can always put them in here once this thing's finished. And the sticks are adding quite a lot of weight. There we go. And I don't know why I have rocks in my hands, but I'm going to drop those as well. And the feathers probably don't weigh that much, but whatever. Every little bit counts, right? Uh, I want to finish the roof first. I don't know why I like to finish the roof first. I just do. It makes me happy. It makes me sleep all at night. And that's what really counts. So that stuff I threw on the ground will uh, show up when I hold down the alt key. That like, I don't know what, I forget what it's called. It's called like focus or something. Um, yeah, the focus key. So that's pretty cool. But um, stuff that drops on the ground that you haven't, well, some stuff that drops on the ground that you haven't thrown on the ground won't show up. Feathers do for some reason but if you're in the mine and you like mine like stone it won't show up in the at least it wasn't it didn't last time i was there um there's been major updates every time i say something in this game it's been proven wrong uh, because of an update so it's like all right whatever um but last time i was in the mine uh that stuff did not show up you know uh the stone and the iron you got to pick it up and then drop it back down if you want to see it in focus um so you know it's something to keep in mind but the feathers you can see i guess it's because feathers are really important they want you to get them all right, and how many, you know what? You know what I can do here, guys? I can roll the logs down the hill. Yeah, hell yeah, I can. I totally forgot about that. That is so sweet. You know what this game needs more than even lights? is some kind of, like, cart to, like, move around heavy objects, you know? Um, fix the whole unstuck thing eventually, but give us horses first and carts and stuff like that. Um, because otherwise, it, you know, it's just going to be too much. I'm pretty sure they left stuff like that unstuck in there. They're like, whatever. Let them use it, man. It's too hard to get around. We want to put horses in. I don't know if they want to put horses in, but there is a horse riding skill, which leads me to believe maybe they want to put horses in. Um, but they're not in right now. So uh, they were probably like, eh, you know, once we put horses in, everything will get better. Um, but for now, let's just let's just let them abuse the unstuck thing for now. And uh, yeah, because um, otherwise, like, it would take forever to get around this game. For ever what's that from I don't, honestly i don't even remember <laughs> you guys can tell me what i got that from sometimes i just spit out pop culture stuff from movies and i don't remember what the hell it was from okay i'm not quite sure how many logs i have down there but it should be quite a few so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna drop these so i'm not so slow and then we're gonna run on down there and put them all into the building erase ya oh man look at me i'm, ru I'm running faster than you backwards bro check me out I'm going to stop for a minute just to make it close. Oh, it wasn't that close. Nice try, dude. Nice try. So we got 12 there, 12 there, 12 there, and 15 there. So we're doing pretty good. Pretty good. So let's see what we got here. Uh, is that going to be enough? Eh, I don't think so. But it's going to get us a lot of the ways through. This thing is super duper expensive with the logs, man. No effing joke. Let's drop the sticks. It's actually nice we're getting so many sticks because sticks are super duper important for me. And can anybody in the comment section tell me why sticks are so important for me personally? I'm kind of curious on who's been paying attention. Let me know in the comments. I'll give you a, like a minute to answer. Alright, so let's come over here and grab these 12. Man, this place is super duper expensive. But it's also super duper dope. Can't go You can't get better than super dope. Wait, never mind. Forget I said that. D drugs are bad, kids. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, sticks are... I'm going to tell you the answer now. Sticks are important to me because I love the stick walls. So, And I go through so many freaking sticks making those stick walls. Uh, fences. Stick fences. Um, I don't like the stick walls in the buildings. But I do like the stick fences. We're going to have enough. You believe that? Do you believe... Oh, I don't. That was the 15. Crap. I thought I had another 15 logs out here. <laughs> okay, we're not going to have enough. Um, how many more do we need? I prefer not to come back with more than I need. I mean, I, mean, I guess it really doesn't matter, but... Oh, we just need five? That's two trees. Let's do this. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. I don't know what that moment of truth would be, but there we go. We're finished. Beautiful. So now we can hold up to 2,100 kilograms. That is just freaking dope as hell. Let's put all these in here. Put all the sticks in there. Let me pick everything up off the ground. And then um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to base. I'm going to just transfer everything that I want to sell into the storage place. Let's see if there's anything else. Yeah. A few feathers. I'm not going eh, to... Don't worry about it. You know, you should use sticks for a lot more than just fencing. And you don't realize how much you use them until you don't have them. <laughs> Which is why I'm uh, going out of my way to make firewood. 
it's easy to collect them, but, you know, I don't want to have to go and collect stuff. I want people to collect stuff for me. You know, that's the, that's the point, right? That's what I'm doing here. All right, guys, so it is the first day of spring, which is uh, legit because we are doing some spring cleaning, or I've been doing some spring cleaning. Hey, I can go up to 480. Oh, yeah, I could put up the 500 sticks in there in my own personal uh, home. That way they don't, they don't get used up as firewood. So it is the first day of spring. I think we do need to look at the fields. Um, we will be farming carrots. We will be farming cabbage. And we will be farming wheat. Yes. Okay, so we're, we've got three things here that are going to be farmed. We've got... I don't think we have anything that's going to be harvested. No. So it's just stuff that's going to be farmed. So we're going to need at least one farmer on this. I think I'm actually going to put two. Just to make sure it gets done and gets done right. Oh, boy. Everything's damaged. And no workers. Oh, well, whatever. I'm not going to worry about it. All right. So you are going to get off there. And then I am going to assign right there. And you will be a field worker. And then I'm going to assign right here. And what is she? Anim animal breeder? I do like the animal breeding thing because I want to uh, gather some eggs, but it's not really overly useful. So it's something I'm, I'm hoping I can use in recipes later on, but not really that useful. So let's bring her on the field worker as well. All right. And everyone looks pretty happy, except for except for Radowit. But we'll, we'll get him there. We'll get him. Everything needs repairs. I'm going to repair off camera. I'm going to be dealing with that crap right now. Wait, three things have to get planted? Oh, wheat will not be planted. Because I planted wheat. Wait. Wheat gets planted in autumn. And then if I plant it in autumn, it gets harvested in summer. Which means I'm not going to be planting wheat again. Okay. Fair enough. I'm still going to leave both of them on there. Because it is what it is. So I've been doing a lot of moving stuff around. And, and you know, getting stuff ready to sell. And this is what I'm looking to sell. A bunch of a bow, stone knives, a bunch of wooden spears, stone hammers. I've got 230 iron arrows. I've got 42 torches. The only thing I didn't make is potage. Um... Yeah, let's sell some. Well, you know, I don't really know if it if it mean if it matters to put potage in there because I think I'm gonna exhaust everyone's money supply anyway. But just in case I don't, uh, let's take a look. Yeah, yeah, my people have plenty of food. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the potage out of here, and I'm gonna move in there. We're gonna sell whatever potage we can. Um, my taxes are due, and they are almost oh over two thousand. Oof, two thousand gold. Ugh. I'm, I'm all thinking like, oh, you know, like I sell this and I make money and maybe it's too much and maybe they should nerf that. And then I look at my taxes and I'm like, no, nah, maybe they shouldn't nerf it. Maybe they shouldn't nerf anything. <laughs> I think it's, uh, I don't think anything needs any nerfs right now because, uh, man, the taxes are real. This is a 50%. I'm going to see if it goes bad. No, no point in eating right now. Your, your food and hunger goes up 100% for some reason when um, the seasons change. So it is what it is. All right, what do I want to sell first? I think we're going to sell the lightest, best stuff first. Although, I'd like to get rid of all this crap. You know what? Yeah, now nah, let's get rid of all this crap. I know I said I was going to mess around with bows, but I'm going to mess around with the um, the longbow and stuff like that. Um, I'm not going to be messing around with uh, uh, with the regular bow. I know they boosted it. I still don't think it's really that good. I don't think it's going to be that good, so I'm not going to... I'm not going to mess with it. I'm just going to go right... Why make a... Why, why mess around with the regular wooden bow? When I've got a longbow that I can make, right? Have I specced into it? Yeah, I have to buy it. Let's see. It's going to be under crafting. Oh, no. that's uh, Is the bow under crafting? Actually, the bow might be under the hunting lodge. Yeah, so there's the bow. And there's the longbow. I've got 500. Yeah. You know what? There. I held it. We're going to give it a shot. Because I think we're pretty far ways off from the, um, from the next bows. So, and I might even mess around with the bow next episode. Now, now I'm kind of I'm kind of wondering if we are far away. Yeah, see that's the recurve bow. We're a good thousand points of survival away from the recurve bow. I don't want to wait. I want to make um. I want to make the longbow and kind of test it out a little bit, see what see what it is. Like I said, I'd rather just melee with the spear and use the bow at range because um, you know throwing the spear I need at least two or three of them in my in my you know because if you throw the spear let's say you have three spears and you throw two of them and you miss or they don't kill the guy outright then then what do you throw the third do you use it as a melee weapon. I'd rather just have a bow. Um, he's got a quest for me to pay my taxes. Wait up, buddy. I want to pay my taxes. Come on, buddy. There we go. All right. Taxes are paid. We're down to 655 gold. That is something. That is something. Hold on, you. All right. Um, yeah, so, so it's not going to sell for a lot, but that's okay. Uh, I don't want to sell my knife. 
Uh, there we go, and there we go. And she's got 857 gold left. All right, I think we're going to be able to make some real money today. Let's run back and get another set of stuff. All right, we're going to sell it to the cow man this time. I'd also like to buy another goose at some point. Because um, when I when I was, uh, when I I was got the goose, I was comparing one goose to two chicken uh, chickens as far as how many eggs I got. So I'd like to get a second goose. Suit. I mean, I guess I could just assume it's double, but, you know, whatever. All right. Uh, where's... I will sell you that. And that, and that, and that, and that. And then I will sell you a bunch of potage. Uh, I got more potage back at base. Just so sell it all. There we go. We're back up to almost 1,500 gold. Let's go make another trip. All right, so I think you guys get the idea here. All right, um, this thing is not nearly as close as I was hoping to get it. It almost feels like it's not really needed, except for the fact that it is closer. <laughs> That's just a fact. And it is also a building that I had to make anyway, and you don't need to make it at your base. So I think this is 100% a good idea. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start taking all of the best stuff. Well, the arrows are the best stuff. I don't see anything. Oh, I wanted to sell the limestone. Problem is limestone is heavy. Yeah, the limestone's heavy. But I think I want to sell it anyway. Um, so, I. oh yeah. That, yeah. I, I, it's not going to sell for much. That's the problem. Yeah, the limestone might be too heavy. Maybe I should just drop it on the ground. I, I just don't like the idea of dropping it on the ground because it doesn't go away. If there was like a trash can and I could like throw the, the limestone into the trash can and have it gone forever... You know, I would do that, but I don't want to be, like, throwing stuff on the ground. It just, it feels dirty. I don't even like the fact that my, the mines I was in have stone all over them. Except for the fact that the mines refresh every season, I think. So all those stones go away. So it's all cleaned up, you know. Um, I'm actually really curious on how much this limestone is actually going to sell for. It's probably only going to be a couple, maybe four, four, two or four gold, something like that. Oh, five. Okay, so five gold is, it's not crazy, but it's enough to not want to throw it away, I think. It does, t it is heavy, though. It takes a lot of trips up here, but whatever. You guys won't be seeing it. I'll just, I'll cut it out of the, uh, <laughs> I won't do it on video, that's for sure. All right. Um, he can't hold. Uh, oh, does it tell you how much gold? Uh, see, it needs to tell you how much gold, because I could probably sell him, I could probably just sell him all of these and he'll only take what he can, but I'm not convinced. And I don't trust the game, <laughs> really, with that. So I'm going to sell these a few at a time. 29. Uh, wait, four? Wait, four. Oh, four. That's all, you can, that's all you can buy. Okay, great. So, like, it wouldn't even let me sell more than he can buy. All right, good. That's really good. So you can actually just hit E, max it out, and you're good to go. Oh, that's really neat. I like that. All right, guys. So... I think this was awesome. I'm really glad I built this thing over here. And um, yeah, awesome. But I do think I'm going to call this one here because this is going to be me coming back and forth and selling. So I'm sure it's nothing you guys will miss. All right, guys, if you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. And for you super fans that stuck around to the end of the video, I got a little bonus content here for you. I was just running back and forth selling torches. First of all, the limestone, I can only sell 30 at a time. And at five gold a piece, I am on board. I'm throwing it on the ground. Um, it's just, it's really not worth the trip. Honestly, neither are torches. As I'm running back and forth selling 30 torches at a time. Um, actually, the torches aren't too bad. They sell for like, I think around four or 500 gold um, for the one trip. Uh, but I can only carry 30 torches. And as I'm running back and forth carrying 30 torches, I'm thinking to myself, you know what, Cage? You know what? You might be better off here um, just... Here, hold on. Let me get some limestone. Uh, 20. See, look at this. I can only, I'm only carrying this limestone because um, I'm trying to max out my trip. But um, I'm thinking in the time it takes me to run 30 torches back and forth, I could probably hit up a good amount of iron from the, no, from the iron mines. So maybe I would be better off putting my time into mining iron than running torches back and forth. I don't know, it's something I'm thinking about. But, alright guys, that's the real end of the video. I'll see you next time.